Hi, my name is Ryan Morgan, and I live in Oklahoma City. I would classify myself as right of moderate, and I did not vote for Trump, and I did not vote for Hillary in 2016, but I still voted. This next election, I'll be voting for um, Biden. I am almost at a loss for words um, for where to even start. Uh, it all started when President Trump was running for office. Things that he was caught on tape saying that I would have gotten my mouth washed out for growing up or that would have gotten linked to um, very non-Christian behavior growing up here in the Bible Belt somehow was permissible um, because he was standing up for the greater good and standing up for um, conservatives. And, you know, that always kind of rubbed me the wrong way. But um, seeing what's happened over the course of the past few years, it's made me very discouraged and disappointed in America, disappointed that people are still supporting him. I can see how maybe his uh, vision for the United States and putting the U.S. first and, you know, making us um, even better than we were before is a very appealing message. But to now see the divisive statements he makes where he says, our people instead of the American people, where he tells people that wearing a mask is a slight against him, where he doesn't joke but says that he told his people to back off on testing so less people would be positive for COVID. The list goes on and on, um, but he, he doesn't care about all people. He only cares about staying in office and, and remaining in power and I am I'm embarrassed right now to say that I'm an American and it shouldn't be that way because so many people have sacrificed their lives for us and um, I respect that and I respect our history and I still believe deep down we have greatness but right now there's so much division and we, we just need to remove the cancer that is promoting the division. The division started before he was in office, but it is so much worse now. And I'm ready, I'm ready to dream of a brighter future. And if that means somebody that aligns with a political party that I have not ever voted for before um, for a presidential election, then so be it.